you have this assumption that it's you know the most luxurious yeah. self-driving well because they start robot. with a door that you can't open so you go wow i don't there's no way i could understand something like this yeah so you get in expecting like a whole new experience so what do you have the same old fucking experience you've had never fucking kia. yeah it's just a kia dude <laughs> <laughs> hell yeah no, dude, I got it. This is this we is, drove one. We drove one to Boston. How it took that? We, we didn't know how to it shut took it off. Weeks. <laughs> yeah, weeks to shut it off. Weeks to shut it off. <laughs> no, we went. We stopped at this this shitty bar, um, and we got out and the car, Tesla. and then we both like hesitated. Like we, there's no off button. Yeah. So we hit the the screen like seven times looking for an off button. Then you just walk away from it. Right, yeah. and it just knows. It's yeah, a, but it's a, we it were. Det it detects your vibes. <laughs> so, because there's no vibes in the car right now. Turn it off. <laughs> Ahead, it was a it shady on. part of Connecticut too. We're just walking away from yeah. The All every Tesla car. charging station is just next to just a crab shack. Yeah. yeah. Fucking <laughs> and what do they cost? Uh, to charge? No, like to buy. Like, Probably fifty. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I think the, the low the end model. is like forty something. The T three. What is it called? Yeah, I don't know. Well, I don't know, but it's really cool. There's the like the, the, it, it, <laughs> it's cool. You see, like it does have a cool display. It's nice on the outside. What else? Was you know, I've always said this. The cars these days, you can hide your wealth. Like, you don't need to spend fifty thousand dollars to like show off. Like no. all these new Toyotas and yeah, you get yeah. a nice white Jeep SUV for three hundred fifty dollars a month. Yeah, you look like the man. A hundred percent. I'm in the fucking market Is that right what now. That costs? Am, I'm in Probably the market. Probably something like that. I have like, no idea. Like three fifty a month if you lease it, or maybe like one of those pre-owned buying scenarios. Yeah. And also, I just want to, I want to bop from here to the beach and I think I might get a, yeah. I might get a Jeep, an old <laughs> school know, Jeep. Where are but we going to the beach? Top down? Yeah, yeah. I go to Long Reese. Beach. Okay. Yeah. Classic. Or Jacob Reese. Yeah. Yeah, okay. And then if I'm stuck, I got no transportation, I'll go to Rockaway. Yeah. Get, taking the ferry home is nuts because you got to yeah, wait in line for two hours. I know. You got to take the really? ferry there and then the Uber home. Yes. That's what you have to do. Yeah. There's no way around But it. the Uber home is like $90, $90 to $100. Minimum, yeah, I minimum. took the train once. I had to piss in between the carts. Yeah. <laughs> it's why you're crushing eight to ten beers on the beach. Yeah, crushing. Crushing. It's really tough to go to a beach that the subway also can go to. Yeah, yeah, yeah It's yeah. not right. And I, no. It's not... It's not right. I don't want to. Uh, also, the Cretans. No the beach is worth a train ride to me. The Cretans on the S train. I don't know if you know what an S train is. It's a shuttle from reality to fucking hell. <laughs> 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 the fucking animals underneath the seats of the S train, dude. I've never. I don't think I've ever been on the S train. It's a portable tent. I mean, people uh, just they just sleep there. It's like hell. <laughs> yeah. Where where does you know, it go? Where does it, it goes from where to where? You take actually? the E train. You got to go to like Wall Street area, and you take the E train or A train, maybe or all the way to Rockaway. And then you get the shuttle that drops you down to Rockaway Beach, like mainstay. Yeah, yeah. Isn't that where the guy was in the Warriors? Did you ever see that movie, The Warriors? Oh, where he did the, the beer yeah, bottles? Yeah, Warriors. He was at Rockaway? I don't know. Come out to play. <laughs> yeah. He's like banging the bottles. I don't even get bottles. the reference, but I like it. I'm into it. I'm into it's, it. it. It's the I corniest mean, I love, musical I, you'll no, ever see. No, it's not a musical. I know. It every fucking time, rules. Every time I see that scene, I'm like, it's a musical. They're yeah. like coordinate dancing in a fucking alley. Is yeah. that the one with the knives and shit? <laughs> <laughs> Right. Yeah, they go, like all the gangs meet up. <laughs> this movie was made in the 70s. Yes, all the gangs meet it. up, and it, yeah, the guy's like, Can you dig it? Yeah. yeah. And yeah. Then, but then that guy gets assassinated by this other gang. The Were they all trying the to get to Rockaway shit. Beach? Wow. What? Yeah. That was, they had to get home to Rockaway right. Beach. Yeah. yeah. So they probably got on the S train. There was like 10 yeah. gangs. Or they're going, Yeah, it might have been Coney Island. Oh. Give me your butt virginity. It's <laughs> fucking dangerous down there when the sun goes down. Yeah. I went to a couple local bars. It's just. Again, just bikers and like degenerates, which is a great time. Yeah, but Dart they leagues. now have a taco stand, so things are looking up. True, I saw that. That was like their big work that they did. They're like, we have a taco stand now. Yeah, yeah. Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> Give me your tired and your poor. We have a taco stand. I've heard people talk about this taco stand. Yeah, it's, it's okay. I heard someone recommend Well, there's it. A, no joke. If you leave at a reasonable time, you can't get on the ferry. It's like, it's like you have to wait three ferries. Yeah. So long story short, you're getting a Tesla to go down to the beach. Yes, so I'm going to get a Tesla. To avoid all of this yes, horror. Yeah. Just leave it running for one of these animals to take a, a joy ride. No Come, as long as they come back. A couple tacos, no we're problem. good. I'm, I, I, I really do want a Jeep, though. I think I, I'm into that elderly old, years. Old school or like one of the new Jeeps? I'd like to get old school. Yeah. But that's like riding a horseback. There's no cushion. It's like... Yeah. <laughs> talk about like shitty interior. Top off? Yeah, I would like that. I don't even think it comes with walls. I don't know what you call that. No, it's just like, like the roll. It's just open. It's, like a piece it's got of the foam. roller for like derby cars. Yeah, yeah. You know, I, I remember there was a girl I was dating that had one of those, and yes. she would drive down the shore, 
and leave the top off. And it's like, I can't live like this. I'm yeah. gonna get, I got yeah. fucking roasted. There's not, <laughs> enough, there's not enough sunscreen uh. in the world to protect me for two hours. I was actually at a like a funeral <laughs> on Tuesday, and yeah. I was in. We drove the per, the woman who died convertible yeah. in front of the procession. <laughs> I have some poisoning. I don't know if you can see it, but <laughs> I was out the next day. I was out of commission. I was fully poisoned by driving for one hour in this convertible. Wait, you got in the convertible, so you knew this person I, really yeah, well. Yeah, yeah, and, and oh. I was in the convertible, you know, blasting Frank Sinatra as you do. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> was that her no favorite way. song it was or her yours? Favorite. Oh, and that's then, sweet. So we went from New York to Jersey where the burial was, okay. and of course, coming across the, the bridge, her last trip out of New York, my way. You have to. <laughs> Dude. Yeah, it was actually beautiful. That's very cute. It was actually beautiful. That's <laughs> very cute. Cut so, to 12 hours later, I'm poisoned. Did you guys like all stick together in the in a line? Yeah, and, like, we wreck traffic. Yeah, so we did like the procession, but this little like it's like a Toyota Solara convertible, you know those? Yeah, like baby blue, and it's leading the procession. So there was zero respect. For the I was just gonna say, dude. <laughs> Nobody respected. They thought They're you like, guys were fucking getting yeah, a free they, ride. Exactly. They go, Zero respect. Being cut off left and right. Yeah. I mean, no I have respect. no respect for the procession. You don't? No. Oh, I do. I, of course you would. I I have such no a fucking respect for the procession. I cut them off. I no, try you don't. Come on. Yeah, I try you to get in the middle. No, you don't. No, you don't. Yeah. Yeah, because I think you are scumbag. Dude, you're the ambulance chaser. When the ambulance comes maps, just meet at the cemetery. No, it's you about don't the to ritual. Stay together. It's, it's about the ritual. It's about the send off. Yeah, and they can't be like this. Where's Uncle Charlie? Yeah, he got cut off at Arby's yeah. by some yeah. fucking because of you miniature mule. Because <laughs> of you, and your fucking Tesla. I've never, I've never actually met someone who's done the procession. Really? What are yeah. you talking about? Have you done a procession? Of course. I've done maybe a hundred processions. A hundred processions. <laughs> yeah. A hundred processions. Have you never lost Minimum. someone? Aren't you Irish? They yeah. die yeah, every we month. We never did a procession. They fall like we rats. Met at the, we met at the church. Uh, uh, nobody no, likes your no, family, dude. Nobody appreciates you. The procession is from you. the church to the grave. So maybe you've only well, done three Well, the grave was next deaths. to the church, I think. Okay. I don't Dude, know. We, looked, we looked into this. Or no, well, they, I think it, they burned them. <laughs> they, yeah, they didn't a burn them. A graveyard? The yeah, they did. No, I've never met cremation. someone. Yeah, I've never been to a, a graveyard as opposed funeral. to a cemetery. One has to be next to the church and one's outside. Yeah, I think a graveyard has to be not. Is that true? I think so. I think hmm. a graveyard is just an isolated yard. Yeah. For okay. prisoners that were never wanted. Yeah. yeah. Just dump them on Rikers. I'm sorry I, to I hate that the somewhere like that. Uh, you know. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I was blacked out. I don't, I don't know what happened. <laughs> did you, yeah. did like you go through red yourself. lights and stuff? Um, no. Those are the we processions I see. It's just, but we were just, in the front, so that's that's not our. That's place probably to be why. Going. So we're never having that problem. People in the back might have to make that choice. Yeah. Not my choice to make. Yeah, had the funeral. The guys who were running the funeral have they ever heard of this before? They weren't happy. Yeah, I bet. They were getting out and talking to each other like, we have to go first. And they're like, the wishes are that this car goes first. That rules. This is her car and this car Damn. goes first. When my dad dies, I'm going to get, oh a, I'm get a Ford Taurus from 94 with one small wheel. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <the> <laughs> a, a missing car door. I just have a giant cigarette burning out yeah. the one side of the window with all the rest and of the like, mop. You lead the procession. <laughs> yeah. You yeah. lead. The Me and my brothers will be in the back seat like with the windows down. up. Yeah. <laughs> the cigarettes going. <laughs> <laughs> what an asshole. Holy shit. He wouldn't even let you crack a window. He would just smoke you out. Yeah. Because mm, it would fuck up with the, the drag and the speed of the, the cigarette it's would not burn wrong, too fast. But that is tough. It's yeah. tough. That's why we all have emphysema. Yeah. It's from we like all, 16 we all problems, on. I know. Yeah. God forbid. Do you think you, we do have emphysema, though? I'm, I don't know. I'm getting worried about this. I've been smoking for 20 years now. I got a cough cigarettes, in the morning. Though, or? Cigarettes and I switched to the vape, but this is yeah. better. I think it's, it is. It's better. There's no carcinogens. Carcinogens. I, I, think <laughs> I don't think it's true. Car <laughs> carcinogens. Yeah, yeah. I think it's, there's carcinogens definitely. But it's hot metal. It's got to be. There's no talk. There's a fucking yeah. battery in it. Yeah. You're just sucking battery. It can't be good. It's, no, it's let's get it. It can't be good. You no, know, it burns clean. <sighs> Nuclear power. This is the Tesla. This is the Tesla. <laughs> <laughs> you understand? This is this is better for the. You got to switch to the Elf Bar. Are you trying to like, uh, pretending that you're quitting? Yeah, I'm, I'm quitting every other day. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. then I'll throw this out. Then I'll smoke a stick. Then yeah. I'll go. You know, this is uncivilized. Yeah. <laughs> cigarettes. Did like, you find yourself doing different things uh, to during the loss of the family member? Did you go back to hard cigarettes? Um, no, I mean, that would have happened anyway. But yeah. You know what? That's a good idea. Let's blame that. Yeah. yeah. I like yeah. that. I like that. <laughs> Dude, my dad's, my dad's dad died, and he wasn't around the family his whole life. And my dad still took... <laughs> he went to the boss. He's like, my father died. <laughs> and he was like, oh, I'm so sorry, Steve. Take two weeks off. <laughs> He's been out of his life for 50, 60 years. And he, at first he goes, no, it's okay. He goes, you know what? 
Yeah. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am upset. I am you so know upset. What? You know what? You're right. You gotta yeah. celebrate. I'm, I'm gonna get my sweats on and play golf for five days. <laughs> Fuck that guy. What What do you need in this parlay tonight? Oh, so much. I'm into gambling right now. Yes. Yeah. I don't. I, yeah. It's good. Um. Let's see. <laughs> so this is a. Let's see. One, two, three, four, Just basketball? five, six, seven, eight, nine things to happen. But they're all right. <laughs> <laughs> but but what no, no, no. this is things. a strategy. This is a strategy because it's all like pretty likely things, like two assists, two rebounds, and I've combined them all together for a plus. It's only plus two seventy five. This could happen. This is the okay. Heat tonight. It's the Heat. Yeah. Bam rebounds, Tatum rebounds, Horford rebounds, a bunch of other shit. Yeah. Just, <laughs> just everyone needs well, to get two rebounds. Yeah, I like doable. it. <laughs> So you, it's doable. you do you know basketball or are you just like the, I do the high? Now. I do now. Oh, you learned in two weeks. I learned in, I learned in ten weeks. <laughs> if you pull up any picture of any basketball player, I can tell you like what team they're on. Yeah, you're calling him Bam. Yeah, Bam. That's his name, right? I thought that's it was his nickname. Oh. No, isn't it? No, his name is Bam Adebayo. Yeah, yeah. He's on the I thought that's his nickname. Keys. No. That's what I they, think his parents were like, there's too many. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe the nickname. Yeah, but, I'm sure but that's you pull up called. his like, fucking... If you look on the screen or in his stats. Yeah, yeah. his birth certificate it got, it ends here yeah. and then it comes down the side. <laughs> like yeah. a first grader. Like a first <laughs> grader writing Merry Christmas <laughs> to <laughs> mom. And you just start going down the edge. <laughs> hey, we'll go bam. We'll yeah, go we're going to go bam on bam. this one. And then I have another one where I just need Butler over 29 points, Brown over 21. This is boring. Oh, that's yeah, good. good. I just sit here and I read you all my <laughs> No, I like it. <laughs> Give away the parlor. I want to know what's at stake. Yeah, this game and will then, be over by the time anyone sees it. But I only bet $10, but I could win $50. Ah, uh, nah. I won $60 go. last night. You got at least. You lost per- a bunch of money the other you night. You think I got right a bet in the hundreds? No, I lost. The last time I lost a lot of money was the Eagles game. I only bet football. Because I know football more okay, than anything. Okay, so I didn't never watch the Super Bowl, but I did bet that there would be an octopus on this last Super Bowl, <laughs> and there was. Really? What? And I didn't know exactly what that meant, but apparently it was very rare. Oh, wait, oh, somebody so threw out an octopus? No, no, no this, this is type is of play. I don't know exactly hockey. what it entails. Mm-mm. Yeah. Super Bowl. So the Red Wings? <laughs> I don't know exactly what it entails, but I know it's very rare, and I know that I said it would happen. <laughs> How would you win? Like one hundred forty dollars. What is an great. octopus? Yeah. Look at what's an octopus. It has something to do with the type of play, and maybe someone. It's got to have eight legs. Runs over right. a person. I don't know. Really? What? I've never. And heard then of I this. also bet there's a quarterback would score the first touchdown, which is also very rare. That's not with those two quarterbacks, though. Well, I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know that. I bet the payoff was only like yeah. ten bucks. Some on guy $10. hitting on you at the bar. He's like, "That's very rare." And then I go, <laughs> that never <laughs> happens. Oh, you got the octopus. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I did. And I was I was working with your cousin yeah. oh, really? that night, and she won a lot of money. Really? I won't say. Is anymore. she gambling too? I won't say. What, well, dude? I've never heard of this. The octopus. Yeah. Very. Oh, rare. Okay, because it's only t- since 2019 became part of the football lexicon in 2019, coined by Mitch Goldich Aiden of Sports Illustrated. It refers to the <laughs> same player scoring a touchdown, and then following up with a successful two point conversion. Yeah, whatever that means. Oh, so it's rare. just eight points. No, no, it's from the same guys. The guy yeah, scores yeah. a touchdown, and then scores the two, the two point, point conversion. conversion. Yeah, that's 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 corny as fuck. But corny, congratulations, corny as all fuck. Yeah, that's corny, corny as, as all fuck. Hell. And he got the octopus. It's yeah. very rare because it's brand new. Yes. So people aren't even talking. People about aren't it. even hip to it yet. They're but not. You know what? They I are now. Am. <laughs> yeah. I, I was saying I was working. I I work with his cousin at a bar, and I was yeah. working with her on um, Super Bowl Sunday. Oh, your cousin works at, she, in is it in Williamsburg? And she hit a bag. No, it's in Manhattan, Murray Hill. Small places. Yeah, Murray Hill. Mm, yeah. Is it a good bar? You like it? I mean, what? I have worked there for seven years. I must <laughs> <Wait>. like it. <laughs> it's not Dukes, right? No, no, no. It's not Dukes. I think Dukes closed. Oh, did it? I think. You want to hear a really fucked up story about Dukes? <laughs> I do. It's Absolutely. a real trash bag bar of like Wall Street bros and then just piglets. Like piglets. <laughs> <laughs> piglets that haven't been fed in months, dude. It's mayhem in there. <laughs> My agent liked it because it was around the corner from his agency. So I was like, ah, I'll meet you there. Bars are cheap, or the beers are cheap as shit, but they're sour because they don't clean their taps. Yeah. The food is, it's, Ugh. oh, it's t- atrocious. Yeah. But I went to go use the restroom and I, <laughs> it's, had, it's one of those uh, black and white checkered old school bathroom floors. I had one growing up. It's a very common uh, style yeah, yeah. marble or whatever. And I saw two, two bags of uh, cocaine. <laughs> really? On the floor. Someone left them in there? Okay. Yeah, somebody dropped them by accident, mm. I guess. <laughs> Unless they were feeding the rats, because in the corner of both bags, they were chewed. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> but they weren't done. Yeah. Oh, no. So. <laughs> you poor took? Did you leave them there? And was oh, it no, actually, I took was it actually Coke? Yeah, it was cocaine. 
Okay, okay. <laughs> Dude, did you uh, see? Did no, you... was this pre fentanyl or post? Oh, this is pre. This is 10 oh, years ago. Oh, thank God. Okay. Because yeah. I, you can't do that anymore. Just, no. You can't. You wouldn't, right? Oh, Today? no, no, no. With no, all no. the Fenty? Yeah, no, I, I haven't done cocaine in a long time. watch other people take it. You know? Yeah, really? Yeah, you let them take it. And then you, go, <laughs> you right, wait. And you good. see if they pass. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. You follow like, them right, in every yeah, room yeah, they go yeah, to. Okay, you go, feeling good? Take your pulse. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Check Look that, at me. Check the pupils. Look at me in the eyes. Look at me now. Look at me now. <laughs> did, you see, did you see last night, like, uh, the, the Panthers and uh, the Hurricanes went into, like, quadruple overtime? Oh, that's the octopus. What yeah. sport is that? Hockey. Okay. And... They were like, they were showing a shot of the coach in the second overtime, and there's a kid behind him just like, <laughs> Oh, the bag of coke! I did! Yeah, 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 yeah. Really? He's literally just yeah, like, he's like doing like this. To stay awake. Dude. <laughs> I thought that was only like soccer dude. hooligans. I get so panicked. I, we used to do that shit for like Eagles games, dude. In the parking lot, but once you go to, to, um, to the bathroom, the public bathrooms, like, I am so anxious to, to, to rip one. Oh, yeah. It's, and these guys, he's right behind the bench, wow. just going, and just what straw right in the bag, or what's he doing? I didn't see. I, didn't I, see. I, I think they cut away. Oof, but he was kid. he was hitting it. He's he was like he was like someone. flicking. Yeah, it. He was getting all the goods to the bottom. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's in trouble with someone. Yeah, yeah. His parents definitely found out. That would <laughs> suck though when you get shit faced for a playoff game. <laughs> it goes into quadruple yeah. overtime. You're like, yeah, yeah telling your boys, Christ. like, look for me. I'm right yeah. behind the bench. And yeah. they're like, we got bad news. <laughs> <laughs> He's got no reception until he gets out to the bathroom. It's like, bling, 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 bling. <laughs> it's like I'm double blackout right now. I'm double OT blackout. Yeah, the whole world just watched you do coke, dude. That's so sick. The last time last time we went to a Notre Dame game, we were with those, like, busting with the boys guys. Yeah. And I was there. there. Yeah. <laughs> dude. <laughs> I was like, I was this is kind of shit. Yeah. <laughs> Time should have been there, man. I was, it was fucking great. With somebody. It was you. <laughs> yeah. He was no. off my back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he was off my ab line. We had a heart to heart. You don't remember it was me? You don't remember anything dude, about that day. Dude. In there? <laughs> <laughs> I somehow drew the short straw and had, we got like, because they don't sell booze in there because it's like mm -hmm. NCAA. So we had we had about they bought the bus with the boys guys got <laughs> a pack I don't of I don't know where they found this thing but it was a box of yeah Nip. nips yeah. and I I had my whole body like it was strapped everywhere it was strapped like a bomb and the and the and I get like wanded and it's like Bee! <laughs> <laughs> The guy, the guy. Chris just hit the vape goal. <laughs> I got nothing. Uh, yeah, yeah. I literally, I, I literally. Peacemaker, that's about it. <laughs> I was in the what war. <laughs> Metal plate, my head. Yeah, Vietnam. Desert Storm. Ever heard of it? Dude, thank God I had a vape. I took a vape out of my pocket and I was like, "Must be this." And they were like, "All right, just toss mm. it." <laughs> yeah. Walked in there, strapped. I remember. I had kept hitting you up. You're like, "I'm out." I'm like, <laughs> "You're not fucking out." <laughs> Security. Yeah, turn, turn him upside down and shake him. <laughs> one falls out of his mouth. I'm like, I fucking knew it. Yeah. The, the, the whole time. Yeah. The there was whole definitely, time. We get to that fourth quarter. It's like, no, you had three. Yeah. Yeah. And the panic that set in my fucking face because I'm not a college football guy. I was just there for the hang. And they're like, yeah, you can't drink inside. I was like, wait, what? And then I started thinking, like, can we link up after? I'll just right, yeah. walk around the rapid views of strangers. Yeah. They're like, ooh, that's kind of my thing. Yeah. <laughs> Enjoying college. I mean, it was fun. Well, it's also brutal when you drink for, like, six hours yeah. before the game, and then you go in. What am I, just going to stand there? Yeah, and they yeah. start getting tired. Yeah. It wears off. Yeah. You can't, you know, there's not, not like a... Uh, it's not that fun going what? to a sports game. Oh. I don't know. It depends on the game. Jesus Christ! What I just said. <laughs> I've been to a bunch of the Knicks playoffs games. Oh, well, it's <laughs> there you go. They lose every I time. I know they lose every time. Actually, my, they won a couple. But my brother year. gets blackout. Yeah. But when and you screams at the players. Also, that's not a. That's not the fun <laughs> ones. Fun is football. Yeah, never. That's number one. Football. Hockey's number two. Hockey. Because they fight, right? Uh, and it's just extremely entertaining. Okay. I'm not even a hockey guy, but okay, going to a hockey that. game is fucking great. Baseball. Baseball. You got to be a fan you get a, of the you game. You get some poisoning. You're, yeah. you're blackout. It's tough. Baseball, you, go, you go for the barbecue and the hang prior. The you get a shady seat and it's a picnic. Yeah, right. it's a picnic. Yeah. Okay. yeah. All right, it's listen. A, it's uh, a picnic with, with uh, Colombians. Right. Yeah. <laughs> Dominicans. <laughs> <laughs> it's your only opportunity. The cocaine picnic. Yeah. Cocaine <laughs> picnic. <laughs> That's at night. But, yeah. all, no, you didn't like a, uh, the Knicks playoff game at the Garden? You didn't? Yeah, that of seems course like I great. liked it, but yeah. there are certain things that are less comfortable than watching from home. Yeah. Like standing next to your brother who's blackout drunk screaming at players. Yeah. <laughs> it's less how, comfortable than how just close being is home. He? Oh, we were like close. the upper, upper deck. <laughs> no, we were, were close. Were you close? Yeah. That's a hard throw. ticket to get. What? Yeah, we're Knicks heads. Holy That's incredible. Shit. Yeah. 
We sit, well, we sit behind the players' families. That's crazy. What's like, your brother doing? And, uh, we have, <laughs> he's behind the guy's mom, <laughs> just being like, you fucking... <laughs> <laughs> and the mom turned around and was like, Kevin Love is really nice. Because <laughs> my brother was going, fuck you, Kevin Love. You're not coming to the garden and having a good time. <laughs> and the mom of a different player turns around and goes, Kevin Love is really nice. <laughs> I was like, no, 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 He no, does no. seem like yeah, a real nice boy. He does. Dude. I like him a lot. But you're not allowed to like him because, you know, he's our enemy right now. Yeah, but he's hot. He's so hot. Yeah, he's that so is, hot. That is that is the ultimate way to kill annoying hecklers around you if you bring yeah. like a bring old lady. Mom. Oh yeah, yeah, or just yeah. any any old lady to a game. Yeah. Remember when we were we were shit faced in Ohio watching Ohio State. Oh, that's a big one. And Shane was running his mouth, and some little old lady was like, "You're hurting my ears." <laughs> yeah. just and then like, I just hit her in the face. Just gonna sit quietly. Yeah. Shut the, the fuck up. We'll let you know. We, we'll let you know when we need meatballs. You dumb bitch. <laughs> Turn the oven on at 20, you fucking idiot. <laughs> Kicks her down a flight of steps. Dude, I nothing makes me laugh harder than watching middle-aged women fall. I said this before. Why? America's Funniest Home Videos, dude. What about the grape lady? You must love the grape lady. Oh, the my God. <laughs> the best of all time. <laughs> don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Yeah. You got to fire that in there, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Stomping great newscaster. It's good. Holy Christmas. Yeah. Yeah, I feel bad. I hope she's okay. I really do. I don't. I hope she's... <laughs> oh, no. You're like, I hope she's dead. <laughs> I hope she so broke her bad. collarbone and has to walk yeah. on no. <laughs> Super fat. Super you, fat people on rope swings. Dude, <laughs> so <laughs> funny. <laughs> dude, Shane and I have a favorite one where this, this, yeah, this meat wagon grabs this <laughs> zip line and... Much like uh, a baby water slide, if you if you have weight behind it, mm -hmm. it's no longer a baby water slide. I learned that the last week. I got a, a hip bruise. I'll get water to it. Slide. I'll meet you there. <laughs> Go ahead, I'll meet you there. But dude, this fucking Aunt Peggy grabs his zip line and she is three and a half women and she's fucking smoking down this hill and she can't stop. There's no break. She hits the end of the zip line, does a full flip. Yes. And it is so funny. Oh, no. It's incredible. No, it's great. It's great. Okay. Also, the, the great lady, you could tell it's the first time she ever got the wind knocked out of her. Because it's fright. If you've never gotten the wind knocked out of her, you think a you're kid, dying. You definitely think, you think you're, you're dying. dying. She's like, I'm dying. Uh, yeah. Woo. So she wouldn't even allow someone like try and help her. <laughs> Dude, you never get used to getting the wind knocked out of her. True. But Every you know you're not going to die. It happens, it's, what, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, you don't know. <laughs> Dude, yeah. Let's. Let's do it. It'll knock your wind out. You will be like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Dude. It's true. I do believe this. <laughs> like, I remember, yeah, it's like I get the wind knocked out of me like, you know, a decent amount of times. I remember it happened in high school the last time and dude, I was me just too. like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> I was like, dude, looking and looking in the ref's eyes like, I'm dying. <laughs> Begging for help. I think I said So this. many people get, oh, sorry. Go ahead. No, go ahead. People have been getting hit in the balls a lot. Yes. In this NBA. I don't know if this is common, but every time I watch a game, someone's down. Yeah. And I go, how do they not wear cups? Because you can't run or something? It would be chafing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Also, they have to wear large cups because they're, they're meat wagons. Are fucking <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. They're other meat it's wagons. big target. Yeah, this is... Uh... They're also probably trying to draw fouls. Yeah. I mean, yeah. at their size... It's... punching in the nuts, though. Really? By yeah. accident. Who's getting punched? I don't know. They say it's not. They say technical. I don't they know. Say, it's bullshit. They say technical, you're out. Yeah, I know. I've seen it a few times since If you I watch started. the replay, it's, they're clearly going for the ball. Right. But I mean, guys that size, they're, it's no longer a jock. It's like, I have to put like a helmet on. It's like a peewee football helmet on these, <laughs> these hogs, dude. Yeah, so it's not even possible to protect. I, I used to wear a banana You cup. think they're all showers? None of them are growers? You don't think any of them... I think they're showing, even if they're about I, to grow, is a grow. Sometimes, sometimes they do show. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah? They are showing, yeah. Yeah, you can yeah. see like the the, the their rich... show is your when, <laughs> yeah. when women watch, watch, yeah. when women watch sure. sports, it's a whole different thing. I go, showing. Showing. <laughs> Showing, love it. To assist, to assist. Is that the octopus? Oh, that's an octopus. Oh, we need to assist. Let's go. Showing, 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 showing. It is funny. I like when they call out like the rich white women in like the front row, like oogling the guys, like as yeah. they like toss it in. You just see some white woman like <laughs> just eyeing down the snake. Dude, dude, if I was a woman, I would hate sitting in the front row because you yeah. can't. They're gonna get you on that no matter what. Yeah, you can't just you can't I just look. If, if they ever, if you ever look at one of the players, they're like, no. she wants to no, fuck. No, no, no. There's a, there's a it's definite. Every time. No, no. <laughs> every time. There was one. Who, it was like Beyonce. <laughs> she was just like watching Le LeBron James play, which is cool. Yeah, she well, can't she enjoy gets that to get for piped. a second. What? She's getting. She's staring at fucking Jay Z's <laughs> face. Anybody looks gorgeous. 
Jay Z looks like an old ball of Tootsie Rolls in the back seat of a hot car. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. That's funny. <laughs> it would be like, like fear, I would be like a box of milk duds. <laughs> like, yeah. You forgot your aunt's hot car. <laughs> Come on. It's like the Jesus. That's on, not racist. It's like a Jesus on the toast kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah. It's Jay Z. Yeah. LeBron's hot as fuck. I like LeBron in like in his like cash gear. You know, like sweatpants and yeah. when he goes to his kids' games. Yeah. He looks hot as fuck. And he shows up like seven hours early. Yeah. To practice. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Puts I, saw, I saw a TikTok reel. <laughs> yeah. They showed up seven hours early. That's why they call him the Dude, greatest I'm... of all time. Because <laughs> <laughs> yeah. while, while everyone else is sleeping, he's working. Nah, that's Kobe. Dude, I, I fell down. <laughs> I've fallen down rabbit holes recently where I, it's like I can't sleep. And it's from like 3 to 9 a.m. nonstop just looking at Jesus. fucking. That's because you take a three hour right nap there. at like the time when people get winding down for bed. Yeah, you gotta cut you the naps. You gotta cut the naps. You gotta fight it. Dude, yeah, put tape on to. your fucking eyes. <laughs> Fall asleep at a normal time, because then you're just you're you're a night nurse. You yeah. got the night nurse hours. I've lived with my I mother for 18 nap. years. I love a nap so much. Yeah, you gotta much. cut it to 30 minutes or nothing. It, his cannot, naps it are cannot sleeps. cannot be four hours. Yeah. It cannot be four that's, hours. He calls a nap four well, hours yeah, sleep. That's not good. I drank too much over the weekend and did a bunch of mushrooms and I had to, yeah. I had to go on a retreat. You didn't tell me about mushrooms. I was eating. You have to go on a retreat. I was coming home blacked out because no one was home. They were away. Okay. I had the whole Wait, house do you guys all live together? Let me just get the... Yeah. Just Chris and I. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Chains upstairs. And then Shane lives Bad. upstairs, yeah. But we were... Yeah, and I would just come home and there was like, oh, you know what? I'm just gonna... I locked all the doors. <laughs> oh, no. I closed the blinds. <laughs> Did you try and beat off? I ate a oh, ton no. of mushrooms and I put on... I put on... <laughs> dude, I put on like a... <laughs> Kids cartoon? No, I put on like some John F. Kennedy conspiracy Ooh, I like thing. It. Why? I, dude, I panicked. What did they tell you? The Cubans or the CIA? Yeah. <laughs> What's cooking today? I think it was a mix of both. Yeah, yeah. I think mix of both. CIA put yeah. the Cubans up. He to was it. over there in Russia for some reason. Yeah, he got a Russian wife. He came back. I don't know, but I turned it off because it was <laughs> too freaky. And I. So you so you're just eating mushrooms for fun. Yeah, so like, then I then I went, doesn't sound like a lot of fun. Care in the world, right down yeah. the hatch. Yeah. And then I went back to basics, put on National Parks documentaries. Now we're talking. And I was so high that mm. I, they, it got ruined for me. How many squares are we talking? It's like four or five. Yeah, that's a lot. Chocolates? Yeah. Yeah, mm. yeah we got so tons good. of chocolates. You want a bar? Cookies by hey, Carol. Take Shout a bar? out Cookies by Carol. Yeah. yeah. What are you making them? No, this lady makes them. I love it when a lady makes them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they're You're really like, good. This lady makes them. I go, we got like, Amen. we got yeah. peppermint. No questions got, asked. Yeah, 100%. If it was a lady making them, I trust yeah. it. A guy touched chocolate? Fentanyl. Yeah, I wouldn't even. Fentanyl. Ugh. Fentanyl. You're dead. <laughs> You're fucking dead. Fentanyl at minimum. Yeah. Okay. There's all weird sperm in there because he's gay. Ugh. There's a lot of straight bakers. <laughs> I was trying to backflip back. <laughs> I was trying to backflip well, back. Are you, are you coming like, out? Like, <laughs> are you just coming out? You like this. <laughs> <laughs> Name them. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Name one straight yeah. baker. Number one, yeah. Julia Child. <laughs> <laughs> Number two, Guy Fieri. Dude, Julia Childs. Holy Christmas. What the a best. monstrosity. What a vibe. Great book. Did you read her book? Did you no. guys like the swimsuit cover of Martha Stewart? As men? I would 1,000%. Pipe that down. You pipe that down. Every decade she's been alive. Peace. Oh. Peace. She is Her younger? You see her smoke. younger? Yeah, peace. Holy Christmas. Yeah. Older, got hotter. She's one of those, you know, women always complain you can't get hotter with age. That's a man. No, you definitely A male can. thing? You yeah. definitely can. You definitely can. can. Yeah. Find Vino on that broad. <laughs> the cock. I like Broad. <laughs> Dude, releasing a vape cough before calling a lady abroad is so perfect. It's okay. You're safe with me. <clears throat> Get a load of the gams on that lady. Oh, God. She's I, so hot. Did she actually do like a spread? Did she? Yeah, she did a spread. Swim really? Swim. Sports Illustrated. I think she she was actually set to do it I, people, a did couple people years get ago. Mad about that or something? No, no one's mad. Everyone's yeah. hard. Every, yeah. Everyone's, <laughs> everyone's too hard to be mad. <laughs> you really can't get mad yeah. in your heart. <laughs> no one has. No one seen that problem. Yeah, though. Who's you're, reading Sports Illustrated? Nobody. You guys reading. are. I don't know. I'm this not, is not my I, problem. This is your issue. I haven't <laughs> touched a sports. That's magazine. just what a fucking weirdo tells his wife. He's like, look, there's a basketball article. Oh, man, right. what a sad guy. And that he is. hides it in his fucking hardware drawer you know what I mean <laughs> my dad had a whole fucking stack of old pornos playboys and sports I feel like even saying pornos just dates it 
Yeah. Nobody says pornos anymore. No? Because it's just porn, right? Because a, a pornos, yeah. it used to be like a tape. Yeah. yeah. So it was like a, th- it was like yeah. a, na- a I'm thing. I'm dating myself. Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, I remember. No, I remember. I mean, I'm, not, I'm no spring chicken. Let me yeah. tell you something. Yeah. Yeah. I'm no spring chicken. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> I'm 35. You remind me of all my cousins. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Are you Irish and Italian or yeah. just all Irish? Just all Irish. You look all Irish. And a little French. Yeah. Like 25 <clears throat> French. That's but okay. I have a fake yeah, Italian accent, so it's confusing. You have what? I have a fake Italian accent, so it's confusing. Where were you raised? New York. Yeah. 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 I mean, it's, it's in New York, Jersey, and Philly. It's all Irish and Italian. If you don't yeah. have either, it's you got but an it's, Italian accent somehow. It's fake. Yeah. Yeah. It's completely fake. <laughs> My mom is like essentially British. She sounds like. But really? was she raised in Brooklyn? No, no, she's from Boston, but she's Oh, like, there you go. Another like, town. No, no, but when she talks, she's like, hello. <laughs> 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 and I'm like, how you doing? <laughs> hey, Ma, how you doing? You've been good. How's, how's the heart? That how's is... the foot? How's the back? Good, good, good. <laughs> and she's like, I made hell. <laughs> That is fucking incredible. <laughs> Could you imagine? Yes, I could imagine. It's just, my life every time. I, I, I just, <laughs> but being her and just watching yeah. her daughter and just, just... And yeah, and I used to rap and like it. I would have songs like Dancing on the Dick, like all these... And she would just be like, <laughs> she, wait, Emma wait, for wait, 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 wait. <laughs> This episode has been brought to you by Manscapes. Let's make Father's Day easy this year. Your old man does not want another rug. <laughs> it's good. Who's brought a rug? Have you ever bought a rug? No, no, no. It says another mug. But oh. I said rug. Oh, oh, oh. That's cup. That's a little improv. No, that's professional nice. improv, dude. That is. Yeah. See how on fire I would have been today. Have you ever bought a rug for someone? This is a rug for us. I bought this. But for I'm saying for someone else, as a gift. I bought it for you. This is a gift. This <laughs> no, is your this gift. Is not, you dude. haven't thanked me this yet. This came with a house. I'm certain of it. What are you talking about? It's a nice rug. <laughs> You're a fucking dickhead. <laughs> you really are, dude. You I like hope- that rug. <laughs> <laughs> you, why don't you buy us a new rug? <laughs> buy yourself a new fucking Dude, attitude. You've been I, I'll terrible lose, today. I'll lose days rug shopping. Your dad doesn't want another mug. <laughs> he wants great looking body hair. Man, it's good. No, he doesn't. <laughs> I just threw a football with your father for like 35, 40 minutes yeah. over the weekend. He's God, ha- what a... He's hairless. What a charm. He is Asian. He's got a, he's Asian everywhere else except for... He's got a nice head of lettuce, though. So. It's a lifetime of wearing suits, dude. You become a hairless baby. Wear long socks? I always wondered yeah. why my dad was yeah. bare from the calf down. Yeah. He, wore, he wore like work socks. It strips. Right it. to the football field. It strips in your manhood. Yeah. <laughs> this dude would get dressed for Sears corporate and then go <laughs> right to the ball field. <laughs> just plucked all his fucking hair off. <laughs> Manscaped's Lawnmower 4.0 trimmer has everything dad needs to get grooming. With a cutting edge ceramic blade, a travel lock, and an LED spotlight so dad can shave his balls in the dark. <laughs> it's the gift that keeps <laughs> on giving, image. dude. That's an image. Imagine catching your pop shaving his nuts yeah. in the dark. Using Just, a fucking a headlamp like a, a coal miner. <laughs> dude, dude, shaving your nuts in the dark is an emergency. <laughs> <laughs> That's when the neighbor's That's wife's coming funny. over. <laughs> She's coming over with you get a text saying, I have extra apple pie. He's like, Ah, oh, give where's the lamp? Yeah. Gotta shave my nuts. <laughs> <laughs> if your dad already has his grooming routine down, hook him up with Manscaped Boxers 2.0 or some preserved cologne to get him smelling as great as he looks. You get 20% off and free shipping at manscaped.com and use code Stuff Island. That's 20% off and free shipping at manscaped.com. Promo code Stuff Island. Don't forget that you came from your dad's balls. This year, show the original home some love with Manscaped. There you go. All right, guys, let's take a moment to thank my favorite sponsor of all the sponsors, Sheath Underwear. Sheath makes the most comfortable. Make this be the day. What? That you get to this line that if you see me, just know, show me your panty line. No. (laughs) I was wearing them last week, though. Yeah, I wore them all weekend. Yeah, I bet. Yeah. (laughs) I burned through them Memorial Day. (laughs) Memorial <laughs> Day weekend. Yeah, you had this fucking hot dog dudes busted, coming out. Yeah, busted my shit. Yeah, they got, they got a ventilation hole coming out the ass. <laughs> <laughs> you ever see a kid in school had like ripped underwear by the asshole? No. Yeah, like you never got dressed for sports. And this is back tidy away days. This is before uh, the sheath technology. So you just had cotton. The dude would blow it out like a fucking dude. <laughs> a true skid yeah, mark on the side yeah, of a road. Yeah. Just scattered holes. Like it was like hit some, with a blowtorch from a certain angle. I used to wear some pretty ragged I, boxers. No one that's listening to this <laughs> doesn't believe you. We uh, we well, of course believe you, you. Literally wore like fucking. 
basketball shorts yeah. under your pants. <laughs> it was a diaper. <laughs> yeah, dude. It was a diaper with spandex lining. Yeah, it was cool. <laughs> I don't know why girls thought that was whatever. not hot. No, they thought it was hot. I'm starting time. to get into like when I see girls underwear underneath the dress when sometimes it shocks me a little bit. It shocks you? Yeah. In a good way? Yeah. yeah. Sometimes it's just like I want a little lingerie that's professional. It's like I how don't tan want all... lines are coming back. Oh, God. I don't remember the last time we talked about tan lines, but a, a, a perfectly placed tan line. Just a glowing orb white, like your forehead as opposed to my forearm. Yeah, yeah. And then it gets back into gold. Yes. Oh. I don't know what it is about that. It's like showcasing the nipple. Like, ah. It makes it seem fresh. It is fresh. Yeah. <laughs> Check their ID. Every time you see my face, just know I'm in the wonderfully comfortable pair of sheath boxer briefs. Their stretchy fabric is made out of moisture wicking technology. They are super soft and they keep everything cool and comfortable and right in place. Uh, sheath is particularly useful for staying cool if you're working out or you're in a hot environment. You know, but you know what? I like them in cold environments as well. You do? I do. I like underwear in any temperature. I, I You know what I've done? I've replaced all my cottons with sheaths. I used to have yeah. cotton briefs Yeah. for the winter. Because I the next day, I wake up the, in the morning, I go to the gym first thing. I can't wear cotton briefs at all anymore. Why not? It's just, it, it's, a, it's, a, it's a tampon. It's a sponge? It's a man yeah. pon. It just keeps all my, my monkey butt in. <laughs> I gotta yeah. fucking wring them out before I put it in the hamper. Dude, yes, it's true. But I like it. Monkey butt, it, swamp it, it, ass. Yeah, it absorbs some of the sweat too. I used to be a guy who just went and bought a six pack of Hanes underwear. Didn't think about it at all until she sent me a pair of their underwear. I put it on and I was like, I could never go back. I particularly love the dual pouches. They keep your man parts separated and it is a it game. It seems changer. really personal, Chris. Yeah. If you're a little bit skeptical as I was, I was so skeptical. That's better. I was. I was so skeptical. At first? When I heard about these dual pouches, I said, what? How? I actually was skeptical. Really? Yeah. I had a hard time for the first week. Putting it in there? It was more for the, the peck through the bird hole. Yeah. The nookies in the pouch, I'm fine with. because no, I, I separate the, the whole package from my body, but I don't like my dick and my balls not to be in constant yeah. communication. Yeah. yeah. It's like you want your lover to have her, <laughs> yeah, yeah. her head in your little, <laughs> yeah, your little nook here. Down there. Yeah. They're spooning. Yeah. If she puts a blanket in between <laughs> her holding me, I'm like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> you might as well sleep on the couch. <laughs> I need the, the the long of the inside of my hammer to be wrapped around my nooks. Do you cuddle all night? Yeah. I, 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 I can do it for a limited amount of time, and then I need my own space. Yeah. Yeah. I only flip because my shoulders get all fucked up. I, yeah. I, I, Peter Griffin. But I also like, I like holding pillows because they don't have any Same. heat. Same. Yeah. No, well, I'll, she'll hold me if I have the, hold the pillow. Oh, really? Yeah, you just flip flop. You take That's turns. Nice. Yeah. Being held is nice. She should start making. How old you after this? You need to be fucking held. <laughs> Today, held I've never nice. seen you like this, and Being I think held it, is nice. Yeah, you've got pickled last night. I don't think it was that bad, but you came out like you were stung by fucking sixty hornets, and I was like, <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Maybe we should push this pod. <laughs> oh, oh, Poor I was, thing. I was just woke up cranky today. I got mad. Someone's take on Elon Musk pissed me off. I haven't recovered. Yeah, you're a fucking crazy person. Uh, <laughs> I particularly love the dual pouches. Like I said, I was skeptical, but I came around. Okay. Because I like to separate my balls from my body. And it's really comfortable. And then you take them off when you're about to have sex and you realize your balls don't smell like your butthole. Oh, my you know? God. <laughs> Now I know when you're ad-libbing. They also have materials like bamboo and mesh for even more cooling comfort. They have bamboo shirts and hoodies for the winter time. Go to sheathunderwear.com and get the most comfortable underwear you'll ever wear. And if you use promo code Stuff Island, you'll also get 20% off your entire order. That's sheathunderwear.com, promo code Stuff Island for 20% off your entire order. It's not going to get any better than that. It's pretty great, man. Yeah. You fucking nailed it. If you're not, if you're not fla- it's pausing the podcast... To buy some sheath underwear right now. You're then I don't a know, fucking idiot. I don't know what else you want from me. Well, maybe they're just dadless. Maybe they were raised by their mother. Yeah. And they're just disgruntled by this big this big day. They yeah. don't want to get a new trimmer or new new shitters. Yeah, Father's Day. Yeah. It's a lot. That's when they, they say... It's when like, is Father's it's Day? It's like Jews during Christmas. They just... They go... You know, fatherless kids go to a Chinese restaurant and they sulk. Yeah. <clears throat> I never even remember Father's Day or Mother's Day. Holidays, holidays. I don't remember. 
You, you, you ever spend Christmas alone? Uh, no. I mean, I was with someone. It was never just yeah. me. Oh, no. I, so I've, I've done it alone. Oh, my God. Just to see what it's like. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> you ever it's cut wild. off a pinky? It's wild, dude. You just wild. wanted to, like, take a trip? No. I didn't do any. I just this stayed. This is like ayahuasca for depressed teens. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> just stayed in my apartment in Philly. What did you tell your family? I was like, I'm busy. Yeah, that, you just said, oh, it's Christmas. Yeah, I'm busy. I can't make it. I got stuff going on. Yeah. And you're literally right across the water. What? Yeah. And they said, okay. Well, I was in Philly. What? Yeah. The Philly's an hour They're and like, all right. They're like, okay. Really? Yeah. Oh, maybe they don't like you. No, we just always, my family's always this thing, like, if you have something to do, then you have something to do. I they, told you we made the right decision. <laughs> they never, they never, like, yeah. It would have been two hours of a dark cloud. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, we got to get in the bed, dude. <laughs> Don't just freeze over. Yeah. I have to breeze over it. Is it Do you have you had this? A, of course. It used to be on Docu- Spotify, but I died of shame one day. I took it down. I was actually pretty good. I had songs like, I'd rather fuck your brother. And that, that's why my name is Lil Fax. <laughs> oh, I was going to ask that next. Yeah. That is so great. Because <laughs> I, I used to rap. Now what, I'm just like, now I'm tall or and old and called Little Frex and don't rap, so it doesn't make any sense. But so you were taking it serious for a while? I'd rather fuck yeah. your brother. Is this, it was a banger. <laughs> Absolute banger. <laughs> I stand behind it. But then, you know, like you die Can you fire shame. it up? When you're Irish, you die of shame sometimes. Okay, yeah, I guess yeah, I could. Daily well, basis. where would I have it on the phone? Dude, Brendan Saglow, I was going to bust his tits. He's actually, Brendan raps. He's probably he's pretty yeah, good. Yeah, no, he's he is. Re- like, yeah, yeah. Lyrically, he's good. Everything I've seen has been great. Yeah. I did it live. I want to listen to. I want to fuck your brother. Yeah, it's so good. It's like, actually. Can we not do that one? Yeah. <laughs> Why you have beef with your brother? You have sore spot with your brother. Uh oh, he's he's embarrassed. He's living with my ex girlfriend. Oh, okay. Well, so, fuck him. Fire it up. Yeah. <laughs> can one of you guys get me another beer and a fucking hammer? You're like not. A- <laughs> it's not for you. I kill myself with a hammer. <laughs> Damn, you know, that's how you know you mean it. You yeah. suicide yeah. by a hammer? Yeah. That guy was in fucking pain. Yeah, you gotta dude. fight through. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You're talking about getting the wind knocked out of you a few times, baby. You gotta dude. trudge right through the hell. I think that would be top video of oh all time. God. Just a guy basically <laughs> every now and then 90% dead. Just <laughs> no, still, no, but you you gotta go night trying to finish the job. <laughs> you gotta go night night for like 20 minute intervals. <laughs> Wake back up and go, it's not over. Why? <laughs> Did you ever see that was did you ever see that video? What? Of uh, the couple there was like a couple that decided to kill themselves with a knife. Oof. Oh god. Kill each other themselves. No, no. And they the guy cut his own throat mm. and then he just he didn't die. No. <laughs> Maybe he was so just, just trying to get rid of his wife and he was like <laughs> and catch yeah. back on his hand. Superficial. <laughs> The same time, okay? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's making like really corny fucking movie sounds like, oh, I can't. And it's <sighs> a video? Yeah. I did this show. Where'd you I, find it? How deep of the web? How I, deep of the web? I did this Probably show. Probably on my lap when I fell asleep. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. This is Tommy just left the TV on. <laughs> <laughs> I shut all the curtains. He's taking mushrooms. I'm just watching death videos in here. <laughs> no, no, I had like a... <laughs> I had a, a moment where I, I it was the anniversary of 9-11, <laughs> the 10-year anniversary of 9-11, I think. That's when you get in a convertible. Or 15. Right years. around. 15 yeah. Breaking, <laughs> <laughs> breaking red light rules. <laughs> what do you want from me? It's 9-11 anniversary. Well, the, the know, bar that me and your cousin work at is a fireman bar, and our shirts yeah. say 9-11. Really? Yeah. I was going to wear the sweatshirt today, but I didn't. Anyway, go ahead. Sorry. Oh, no. <laughs> Wait. Did, did you, what does it say after 9-11? Did you Jay Gomez? All gave some, some gave all. The what? All gave some, some gave all. Ah, uh, what? All gave some, some, some gave, gave all. all. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> you go, huh? Okay. <laughs> I thought it was yeah, gaming. Like, yeah, like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like how I wish just fucking bar. All gave some, some gave all. Some gave all. Some gave all. Some gave all. The fine were coming in just doing that fucking. <laughs> all right, sorry, I interrupted you. Uh, yeah, stop sexualizing those little Irish girls. Wait, do you know who Louis J. Gomez is? Yeah, of course. I don't know him personally. Have you heard I the story he that he he rollerbladed oh, no. out of the city? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh, no. Dude, I cried. <laughs> I cried laughing. Nine eleven. 
<laughs> oh man, where's Prince? Give me the rock. Give me the rock. George Washington. Dude. George Washington. He, 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 dude, he, he rollerbladed to like Nyack. On the, <laughs> dude, on the side. He went through all the. <laughs> <laughs> that's Haley. That's Haley. You have to go up. You have to go up a lot. You have to go up a yeah, lot. Yes. Getting up the ramp. He was talking about turning his, <laughs> his rollerblade sideways and going up until he got to the top and just went. <laughs> What an incredible story. Jersey fire engine coming <laughs> the other way. <laughs> Holy fuck. It's unbelievable. Oh. I think oh. Soder told that story at uh, Big J's cookout, right? Yeah, yeah. Or uh, Ari's. Jesus Christ, it was yeah, so it was funny. Ari, yeah, oh my God. That was the funniest fucking thing I'd ever heard. Now, you know, I have to ask. Did what? he have soot or no soot? On him? Yeah. No, no, so, no, so. no he was he in like. Completely clean. He, I, think, <laughs> I think he said he was living in Jersey at that point or something. No, oh, no, he, he was living in. Oh, he wasn't. He New was York? living in Chelsea oh, okay. or something. He was living. <laughs> I think he was living. That makes like, sense. You gotta get the fuck out. I think he bought. I think he he was he was living in like a closed down doggy daycare. Oh no. <laughs> That's what they said. It was just tile floors. <laughs> oh my god! It's <laughs> <laughs> a boiler room for dogs. He's got just, I gotta go. Yeah, his girlfriend. His girlfriend was uh yeah. Oh my god, Nyack dude. or something. <laughs> so funny. God damn it. But so. So that was a tough day. <laughs> yeah, yeah, a tough yeah, day dude. for the city. <laughs> Where were you on nine eleven? I was in sixth hurt. grade, seventh grade. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I. Yeah. The mood turned somber. No, no, no I like everyone you. fall. A hush fell over the crowd. So you, you couldn't. <laughs> Where leave, were you? On you couldn't day? leave school. No, we couldn't leave school. And a lot of people's. We were close enough to the city. A lot of people's parents worked there. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We exciting. we had that too. And then they, yeah. of course. <clears throat> if, good one. Sorry. They, okay, during <laughs> I drank that story, very, really? <laughs> very fast. I started thinking about ladies falling. I got really thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> that's a, that's how I started watching Gore videos. Home, please? I think there's one in the freezer. Um, oh, yeah, they wheeled the TV in. Yeah. And they showed us the live falling. Uh, yeah. yeah. No, that can't I, be right. Adam Friedland loves to hear this story. He actually told, I just did his show in yeah. Brooklyn. He told it after I was done my set because he can't stop laughing about it. But I was, I was supposed to go to Paris on 9-11 at 3.30. Okay. And it was my first time ever leaving I've only been to South Jersey beaches at that time in my okay. life. I was like 22. And you were going to go to the South of France? I was going to go, And yeah. live life? I, I did that, put a pin in it, come back. Yes. Go yeah. ahead, your story. And uh, I was very excited. Mm -hmm. And my middle brother is obviously an extreme fucking bully. Mm -hmm. And I wasn't, I was, I was sleeping in during the first, <laughs> the first plane. <laughs> <laughs> and I got awoken by his call. And he was like, hey, guess who's not going to Paris? No. And I was like, shut the fuck up, do you what? And he goes, uh-uh, turn the TV on. Oof. Yeah. And then I watched the second flight, and then he calls me again and goes, I told you. Oh. <laughs> Dude. That's like a cartoon bully. Hey, guess yeah. he's not going to Paris. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's so it's unbelievable. Guess it's he's horrible. not going to Paris. The uh, one time I was going to escape uh, Philadelphia. <laughs> <laughs> it's not <laughs> No, dude. Talk about the fucking cloud of doom. Dude. <laughs> now is this the same brother who's done this yep. unspeakable act? Yep. Yeah, you're traumatized. Yeah. This is bad. Yes, this is great. Bad. This is fueling my career. Yeah, I found out. Yeah, I found right out to from, the top. Yeah, baby. Right to the top. Yeah. I found out from Joe Benoit. Who? This kid. In my That's Benoit. Oh. No, he's Joe Benoit. This guy was an asshole. Benoit, this and Benoit. I walked into yeah. class and he was like, he was like, a plane just hit the towers. And I was like, oh my God, is this an accident? He goes, yeah, it's an accident. <laughs> <laughs> and, he said, I knew. and I was like, what the You're fuck? Like, okay, it's yeah. an accident. Okay. Yeah, yeah. He's like, okay. Sounds like you took on his personality <laughs> since. <laughs> That's how you dude, respond to that. Dude, I immediately <laughs> left. I went down to the water and I watched the. The second. No, I didn't get to see the second one hit. The second one had hit already. But I couldn't get in touch with my dad. My dad was downtown. Yeah. <laughs> Tell, can you please tell the story? Now? <laughs> what? Just do it. <laughs> what? Your fake 9 11 story. Oh, yeah. I lied about 9 11 <laughs> for okay. a while. And what did you say? You were there? Well, my dad. <laughs> Your dad died? What happened? No, no, no. My dad was going over the Williamsburg Bridge. Can I set this up real quick? <laughs> yeah. Sure, sure. We had Rena's Easy on, who we okay. love. Yeah. And he had that whole thing where he, he made up a story. And I, Chris and I were talking about it. I was like, yeah, I can. Chris is like, I can understand. And I was like, 
we had this like back and forth. It's like, oh, wait, how could you possibly understand? He's like, I lied about 9 11. Yeah. <laughs> he said like that. It's yeah. just a random night. And I was like, wait, wait, <laughs> hold on a second. Yeah. You what? Well, my dad was on the, the train going over the Williamsburg Bridge and saw the first plane hit. Okay. Crazy. That's a wild view to have. Yes. And then that is and it was that's 10th that's row or Knicks game. That yes. is. Okay. Hope his brother then, isn't with them. And then he got off the train and been. saw the second plane hit. There was like they were right on the water in Williamsburg. Him him and everyone in his like it was just engineers in an office standing at some like building, just watched the second plane hit and then watched the towers fall. And so I told this story Train. to someone. <laughs> yeah. Right on cue. I told this story was to someone at, you know, correctly, truthfully, mm -hmm. that my dad was in that situation and they were like, Yeah, that's that's wild. And I didn't <laughs> like that reaction. <laughs> Yeah. So then I put myself <laughs> on the train yep. and I started getting the reaction that it deserved. Yeah. Yeah. So I did that for a while. And it's just like <laughs> Man, I didn't like that reaction. And I didn't like that reaction. <laughs> I took offense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I took offense to that. And I took yeah. offense to that. Yeah. It's a Jordan meme. So I lied about 9-11 for a while. Okay. How many people did you tell it to? Uh, Honest, 3, honestly. 3,000? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> One for each death? <laughs> Not that I just did it at my JFL audition. And, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Well, sweet yeah. in the pot, wrote a whole, put on my wrote, resume. Wrote a pilot about wrote, it. Yeah, wrote a pilot. This my like closer for a long time. Wrote a short story. Had it published in the New Yorker. Ever heard of it? Uh, not that many people though. Yeah. Um, Changed my last name to Brown, but uh, that was fine. Well, oh God, I think dude. it's okay. Yeah, you can lie about 9/11. If you're, Listen, you should close. And... If they're gonna lie to us about it, yeah, I'm yeah. gonna make up my own lies about it. <laughs> Damn. You can't say that in your fireman bar. It starts at the top. <laughs> Accountability for all. That's so funny. Dude, do they come in in their, their unis? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you guys get all hot and bothered? Is that like a thing? Well, this St. Patrick's Day, let's put it this way. I was like, if someone does have a fire in Manhattan, I mean, God rest their soul. Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. they're all here. Yeah, <laughs> so yeah, yeah, yeah. What are we going to do? Yeah, yeah. You gotta, you is gotta, is gotta, it right gotta next fire. to, is it just a fire-themed bar? What is this? Fucking it's Applebee's? It's... <laughs> It's you own. gotta go like yeah, Jewish rules on St. Patrick's Day. Like, yeah. Don't turn any it's lights like, on. Yeah. Don't, Can't no electricity. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. um, oh, it's like it's a holy day. Yeah. It's, holy day. Yeah. it's uh it's owned by retired firefighters. He's retarded? <laughs> retired. Oh, retired. <laughs> that would be <laughs> what is, this, this, bar, the best, this is the best bar of all this time. This bar is owned by two <laughs> retired. <laughs> Dude. No, no the fire's retired. that way, Carl. No, 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 no. no. Retired. Pointing out his feet. All right, come on. No, no. Tom. <laughs> come on, pull it together. Pull it together, Tom. <laughs> Jeez. Jeez. Jesus. Christ. Just, just throwing all their macaroni <laughs> necklaces at it. Just buckets of confetti. <laughs> okay, from the top. It's owned by retired firefighters. <laughs> you got a thick it still accent. sounded like I know. It's fake. How can Am it be I, that thick? What do you not understand? They're retired. <laughs> <laughs> They're retired. <laughs> They're retired. <laughs> Oh, how'd they get the job? <laughs> He's still got to work there for a long time. <laughs> no fear retired. of these guys. No fear of these yeah. guys. Oh, feed them after midnight. I know that. Yeah, okay. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Like now, well, I'm fired. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going to be fired. No, no, no. no. I'll put you out. <laughs> oh, Jesus oh, Christ. Okay, shit. I don't even know where we're Anyway, so anyway, it's owned by retired. Who cares? 9-11 is the cop. Uh, it's, it's a, it's a, it's a oh, yeah, strictly just... fireman bar. No, 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 no. Oh. Locals bar. Do any of them believe in the conspiracy? You know, I haven't brought it up. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I gotta be honest, I haven't brought it up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like having a you CIA bar. Like, did you guys kill fucking JFK or no? <laughs> anyway, what do you want? Pint? Yeah. <laughs> you guys want waters? What do you want? Stella, shock top, we got a couple IPAs. <laughs> yeah. I can pick one for you. Yeah. I know they're kind of all the same. <laughs> You see how his oh, fucking shit. head blew off like that? <laughs> Seven shooters. That's all I'm saying. Anyway, you want jalapeno poppers or mud sticks? <laughs> Dude, with vape smoke flying out of every orifice. It's so great. Clip it. Clip it. Just, just tell me, how'd you do it? Well, oh, man. I that was a ride. That was a wild ride. <laughs> that was a wild ride, dude. Yeah, that's good. 9 well, Oh, 
But so this is how I wound up because I it was the 15th anniversary of 9/11. Mm-hmm. And there was an article I think in the New York Times, <laughs> the noises about how like all the videos of people killing themselves are like we don't watch them or talk about it. So they're just on like these gore sites. Mm-hmm. And then is that the best way you can't find to jumper treat videos. these things? Yeah, yeah. You can't. It is the best way to fu- treat these things, I think. Yeah, yeah. 100%. But it, instead of like acknowledging it and like, and, and clip publicly. It and make it a real? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's the best way. Hi, this is. I don't know. They were clip asking it. some pretty deep questions. <laughs> clip it. Clip and it. So, 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 so then I, I was like. No, no, no. I did. I did. <laughs> no, no, no. Well, they got me. Right, I was go like, go I gotta go start go watching go gore. Go. I gotta start watching gore stuff. I don't want to be one of these people yeah. who's not watching people jump out of the house at nine eleven. I don't want to be one of these ignoramuses. Yeah. And then I went down a deep rabbit hole of just violence. Yeah, I get it. I mean, there's two good. types of people in this world. You either watch the beheading videos or you don't. Yeah. I think you, you either have should to watch know, some You either have them. to know or you don't have to know. Yeah. Just like you know all the players' names. Yeah, you, you show either, me a exactly. montage of beheading videos, I'll I tell go, you. I go, oh, that yeah. was, uh, West, That's a that was Westport. <laughs> <laughs> he actually worked at J.P. Morgan. They never, saw it. <laughs> they never saw it coming. They never saw it coming. Beautiful. Anyway, next. <laughs> Oh, Chicago. That was a good one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like being badges on the... Uh, nah, I can't say that. All right, good. Oh, hey, I like that a little... Uh, yeah, yeah, I yeah, reeled it said, in. I can reel it in sometimes. I, like I know what's yeah. coming next. Yeah. <laughs> I never do. What <laughs> 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 the fuck? <laughs> That's what happens when I hold one in. Fuck! <laughs> Fucking... <laughs> what's that men in black with are <laughs> just fighting that creature coming out of their skin? Oh, yeah. It's a good Classic. movie. God, I'm really bringing this to a fucking wait. Hole. So, do you not watch gore stuff ever? I don't know what You've the seen I don't exactly know what the deep web is, but like it's not deep. I got I got a site for <clears> you. But like, I'll go on. <laughs> I'll flip your wing. <laughs> Super accessible. Um, yeah. You got Twitter. <laughs> like, I'll True. watch like the beheadings yeah. during the during like the ISIS time. Yeah, I don't know yeah, if ISIS yeah. time is over yeah. or what. What's the real? No, nah, it's not really over. It's just control. No, but like yeah. it's all. Time. It's uh. It's like when. There's a few mice in a kitchen in New York. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah they're kind of like... Zap them. They're like the T-1000 they're still behind the walls. in Terminator right. 2, you know what I mean? Where it's like they'd split up, but then they... Yeah. Like, you just don't want them turning the rats, chewing through the again. fucking machine. All right, well, you guys are really going off the rails here. All I'm saying is... <laughs> hey, yeah, I've seen a few of the videos. <laughs> you watch the journalists. <laughs> Did you watch the high, the high production ones where they're like, they put them in a cage and burn them? No. Oh, dude. No, don't even tell me about that. I don't no, know. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. no, 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 no. Let me At tell you something. What, they use the black magic? What happened? Yes. They were, what they filming on? Yeah. The black oh, magic? all the they goods. They were using like After Effects. Their production <laughs> team is unbelievable. Premiere Pro? Well, Premiere no. Pro. There's three that At some that point, were... we drone striked a like edit bay. Oh, no. <laughs> so they can stop <laughs> making these fucking videos. Yeah. But there are three like very high production videos. One was a cage fire. <laughs> Uh, one was they they dropped them into into water and this, then dude. This, yeah. no you can cut from that part and then you can come back at this dude. part yeah, yeah. this is Wait. it this is uh, one let's pick up from burning in cage <laughs> <laughs> let's pick up from <laughs> let's, pick right? up, uh, let's pick up where ISIS is burning that guy alive in a cage we're a history podcast dude <laughs> Chris, you guys, are, you guys Chris, are the new hyenas. Chris is, uh, doesn't have any technical know-how. Is worse than me, I think. I but uh, he set up the podcast on Spotify as we're we're two, mm-hmm. so that we have ratings and we can't combine them all. <laughs> have, and he doesn't want to delete. We have there's, there's this is your uh, name and his name. No, no, oh. it's Stuff Island. It's yeah. Stuff Island, but one is science and technology, oh. <laughs> one, is, one is comedy, and they have two separate channels. Two feet. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, but the feedback yeah. is so good on both that. We, <laughs> We don't want a 911 one on the channel. <laughs> how how are your ratings? So I just started a podcast. First of all, yeah. not that easy. No, no it's not it's easy. Speak and complete sentences, huge pain in the ass. Yes. What a fucking nightmare. <laughs> Dude. And then you constantly have to go mark that, edit that out, mark that, edit that out. We don't do oh, that. Yeah. And also you're not getting that edited out. <laughs> yes, I am. I'll burn this place to the ground. How about that? How you about, we call your fire how about, how about, I'll make a gore video. I'll burn your house down. <laughs> How about that? Just leave the cameras on. We'll be high production. <laughs> Wait, what were we saying? Oh, yeah. So, and I'm, I haven't gotten any negative reviews yet, which is yeah. how I know that I'm not shit yet. Yeah. Like, um, you're not uh, shit until you get negative reviews. I got to say, mm. that's probably not true because you're, <laughs> no, you're funny. I, I just met you, but 
usually the negatives will come Crazy. early and then late by maniacs. Right. We didn't. I hate that. I actually don't even want to say this, but we we've been. Yeah, this is we had fire way to get terrible comments. No, I think I think actually, we got, most of the comments have been pretty good. Yeah, yeah. we get we That's get good. a lot of support, yeah. and but people will find the, it. Yeah, you get one person who's always like, so I was like, couldn't finish it. Yeah, yeah couldn't yeah. listen. Why are these guys laughing so much? Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah there's always one. There's oh, we're like, laughing because we live in a clip economy and you can't <laughs> clip it unless everyone is dying laughing. Okay, you have to be dying laughing. Like, no, there literally was like two dudes. Yeah. <laughs> two dudes. Two dudes. Trolls. Two trolls. Yeah. Okay, that's and you can cool, hit though. their you can hit their comment history and they'll jump up just oh, yeah. to say something negative. Negative. They're just fucking Dude, that is funny. sad people. That's kind of cool though. Two trolls committed to ruining your day every day. Well, they got to log hot. in. That's hot. I like that. That's like. Fucking hate these guys. Can I take them down? Yeah, yeah, take yeah. Them down? Gay. Sometimes a terrible comment is attached to like they've commented on every up ep- every other episode, being like huge fan, love the show. Really? And then all of a sudden, it's just like these motherfuckers. <laughs> they're never gonna make it. There was one dude I made fun of like Catholicism and like having a family young, and it, it took him into a fucking Not whirlwind of hate yeah. <laughs> for like weeks. He's like, this guy, he's for his age, he doesn't know love. And, like, <laughs> He's like, God is real. He's not. Like, it's unbelievable. And it's still something that you you read it and you're like, God. That'll stick with me. <laughs> yeah, a, yeah. You're going to read a really thousand hurts, wonderful man. comments. There'll be one fucking of dildo. Of course, always. Yeah. Yeah. I still remember, like, the meanest um, YouTube comment I got when I was a rapper. I'll recite <laughs> it for you now. And quotes. <laughs> Please. This fat ginger bitch ain't dancing on anyone's dick. <laughs> and, end quote. Oh my God. That's a new line. I just died laughing, but also I was like, I'm so hurt, but I have to repost it right away. <laughs> <laughs> It'll stay with you. And I don't remember any nice thing anyone's ever said to me. Yeah. But I'll remember that for the rest of my fucking life. <laughs> that is so, so funny. <laughs> this fat ginger bitch ain't dancing on anyone's dick. <laughs> it's so funny to just sit there and be like, yeah, but what did you think of the song? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah but it was funny, right? Like the it was beat, funny though. Song. Yeah. The beat, though. Yeah, love the beat. Good beat. production. <laughs> good production, bro. Yeah, sick beat. I wouldn't beat those cheeks, ginger <laughs> core. Not for a million fucking dollars. That's balls to so start rapping online. Yeah, I mean, it's the SoundCloud um, heyday. Yeah. So. Isn't that what's happening now with all like the pop? Didn't they start SoundCloud? All the popular rappers now. Yeah, yeah like Post Malone, I used to listen to on SoundCloud. Yeah, is SoundCloud still happening? Uh maybe or? in like the deep sense, the deep yeah. web sense. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, it's, I don't know. That's it, the only place my music. Still SoundCloud is. and ISIS. Yeah, SoundCloud. <laughs> ISIS is on SoundCloud. <laughs> they actually have some pretty good stuff. <laughs> um, just screams. SoundCloud is still happening, I think. But I don't yeah. know. I'm too old for that. That's just a platform you can upload your music and yeah, you just do it free. yourself. You don't make any money. You make the beats yourself too. No, I used I used to just tw- I used to be that person tweeting need beats send beats <laughs> to send beats to this you is know, my email. so funny. It is. It really is. And what? Is, how how old were you when you started the, asking? Out on the street. Twenty five years old. Oh my god! Late, late, oh my, <laughs> like yeah. like objectively late to start asking for beats on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> like, that is so funny. Like Did anyone late. ever send you beats? The best beats, and I use I would use them all the time. Really? You pay and them? And then here's the thing. No. <laughs> so that, but I would I didn't make any money off of music, so it was like I would just send emails like, "Hey, you got any more beats? Uh, sorry, I haven't ever paid you, but." You know, we haven't made any money. So, <laughs> yeah, yeah, what's fifty yeah. percent of zero? We're working together here. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wait, no, that was that was the big thing. It was like, let's build. Like <laughs> that was the big like SoundCloud rapper lingo. Yeah. Um, oh, we're building. We're yeah. building something yeah. here. Yeah, that's every yeah. fucking booker now that does that isn't yeah. a comic. Yeah. It's like, look, you get stage time. You're getting your voice out there. You're part of a community. I get all the fucking money. You meet people. God. I'm Booker's so bad managers. at stand up. You guys both are good at stand up, right? You, you don't do stand up? Yeah. I do, but I'm not good at it. Well, it takes a while. I feel like Yeah, you and I'm would not willing to it. work. I would be, but I'm not willing to put the work in. <laughs> I don't put the work in. That's that little yeah. Frex attitude. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, That's like, how I'm going to fuck like, your brother attitude. Like, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You got to get that demon out of there, dude. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We got to extract that demon. Give me the incense, will you? <laughs> You're not going to like this dance. <laughs> <laughs> getting a little oh, I can't even tell you that word no like either. I start I didn't decide to switch from music to like straight stand up comedy till I was like 30 and by that time I was going to open mics I go I can't Can I, I started 29 doing open mics and okay I had so a maybe I'm job. just complaining for yeah. fucking no nothing. you just gotta do it I know you're funny enough I know but then you stand up there and you have to like say prepared material nah you, <sighs> a little bit of both 
going to be tough. Do you hate repeating yourself? Yes, I did. Yeah. Yeah. I felt like a fucking hack oh, every time. Yeah, I, I'm yeah. like, I just said this yesterday. It never and gets old. And that's the whole thing that it is. Yeah. You say the same thing you said yesterday. I know. But then you get a run of good shows and you're saying the yeah, same thing you said you yesterday go, and everyone's reacting like you said it for the first time. And, and you're you go, like, fuck it's it. It's still good. I mean, look, yeah. I've said a few bits on this podcast that I've said before. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah. That's okay. Yeah. Honestly, I might be doing, I'm doing sit down right now. I'm doing sit down comedy like right it. now because I came on here and I did material. That's fine. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, that's that's all we do is sit here and try not to say a thing that we've said already. Yeah. Right. And right. it's been... Yeah, it's been. <laughs> yeah. I mean... <laughs> I've been doing impossible. that for five years. What? When people say it's been, I sing that. <laughs> it's, it's been. been. It's, it's, it's a problem. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's a problem, dude. <laughs> yeah. If you're struggling on stage, that's also a good move. You say... A boom, boom, boom. <laughs> well, that's the other thing. Like, as a rapper, now I'm about to do a bit again because I would do this. Like, as a rapper, you just tell people what reaction you want them to have. You're like, yo, make some fucking noise. Yeah. Yeah. Stand up. And comedy, you can't, like, do that. Yeah. You go, laugh. Yeah. Or you just dress maybe, like a. Maybe you can. No one's done it before. That's so true. Yes, yeah. they have. I bet Sinbad. Did. There's a bunch of girls that dress like whores and say, ask you to clap for them. <laughs> <laughs> I can't support that comment. I'm sorry. You know who I I'm just talking. have to go on the record as not supporting that comment. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's one person. You, you don't have to edit not, this out? I, I don't even know there, who you're thinking no, of. No, let's go back to this prepared material shit because okay. there's one person that I. <laughs> oh, no. I, I, I'm scared. I don't even follow. <laughs> It drives me insane watching them because you can, you can almost see they're so overly prepared where you can you can almost see them saying the jokes into like a bathroom mirror uh, and see. like it's everything every movement every pause even though people aren't laughing right they yeah. pause right and then it's like and then this and then there's like three examples they go by the number of three it, it is an, so fucking LA, douche chilling yeah it's a bit of an la comedy vibe oh god it's a little Formulaic. bit it's a little bit overacted i see yeah well here's what no I'll it doesn't even you, have to be acting no, but here's just, what's going on it's like people are getting on stage that are trying to be actors and actresses yes and the managers and the agents are telling them you need to be on stage because you need somewhere that we can tell people to go see you so you should do stand-up comedy anybody could do it Oh my and then people God. are getting on stage. And honestly, that's what I was going to do. <laughs> really? <laughs> and I go, this is so disrespectful <laughs> to the people who are so just, good at this. Because when, <laughs> when you stand on, like, when, you, when you're watching someone who's meant to do specifically stand-up comedy, you know what you're watching. Yeah. You go, that's a stand-up comedy. Yeah. And then you know when you're watching someone who's auditioning for the bear. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got a law and order face. Yeah, Get the we, fuck off the stage. We know when we're seeing an SVU audition. <laughs> yeah. God damn it. That's embarrassing. There's just, just something so funny about you walk into like your manager's house. I just imagine a guy behind a giant stack of papers yeah, in- and he's just going, listen, <laughs> dancing on that dick's not moving the needle. <laughs> It's not moving the needle for us. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think about yeah. like stand up comedy? Yeah. What do you think about a type five? <laughs> yeah. Can we can we scrap that together? Type uh, five? Yeah. We're gonna pay emo anytime this decade. <laughs> I'm looking through the lyrics here. You got some good stuff. <laughs> You said, you said, wink, wink, kissy face, puppy on a pony. He's texting mad emojis. What he really means is blow me. I'm sorry. You need to make that into a bit. You need to get a type five. Right away. Dude, apparently that, that's, how, uh, that's how little baby started. He was like really, really good at Twitter. Like oh, he was Twitter. just tweeting like, like all these comedy analogies and shit like that. And his one boy was like pushing him like, yo. Make this into a song. He's like, I'm, he was too shy to rap. Do you ever see his uh, documentary? Really? It's actually really good. Really? I'll watch this. Yeah. I think it's on Amazon. I like Little Baby. Yeah. I like how Drake uses Little Baby to get the young kids, but it also introduces me to Little Baby. Yeah. Okay. Same. Baby. Wah, wah, wah. Bitch, I'm a baby. Best line ever. Yeah. <laughs> I think that, that that's either him or Duh Baby, but they have a song where he goes, wah, wah, wah. <laughs> Bitch, I'm a baby. Yeah, I go. That's that's good. Let's get this fucking money. Let's get this fucking money. We're building. Yeah, we're building here, bro. We're building here. Wow, 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 bitch! I'm a baby. It'd be so funny to scream that at someone in a relationship. (laughs) (laughs) Oh my god! Immediate, immediate fucking plate up against the wall. (laughs) What up? Yeah, you're gonna get your shit broken. What's the name? Yeah, I'm already mad thinking about it. I know. I'm pissed. I'm pissed. Yeah. Just taunting somebody. Wah, wah, wah. Yeah. Bitch, I'm a baby. <laughs> yeah. 
you clearly don't give a fuck anymore. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah what is the name of your podcast? Over that one. <laughs> Skedaddle. It's called That's What I Heard. And is it just you or somebody else? It's me. It's just me, but then I have uh, Sebastian Canelli, who, who you guys will love. You should have him on. He's like a definitely. He's like my co-host. And then I got this kid, Billy June. So the kid, Mike. I don't know. I keep promising the listeners we'll get more women and some guests, <laughs> yeah, but yeah. they I have not guys, yet I got a stable guys still making beats go, for me. I go, I go, yeah, I think this just might be what the podcast is. <laughs> That's me fine. and these four degenerates. <laughs> Are you guys on the whole time together? Yeah. Wow, you have four That's mics. Good. Yeah, four mics. And then you have a fifth mic. I would kick one of them off my if I were to That's have a guest. That's gonna be a But here's the thing: I don't want open mic comedians as my guests. I want Bad Bunny. Yeah. Oh, I what's a, what's a, a, do you have like a theme or some shit? No, just chit chat. Say what I heard. Yeah. I'd yeah. answer questions from the DMs. Perfect. We oh, that's the, cool. We do the Shame Olympics where I talk about what's eating me alive with shame that week. <laughs> what's eating you alive with shame this week? Parlay. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's like the one thing keeping me going. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. All sins are My, forgiven <laughs> as long as everyone gets two rebounds. I'm literally and two like points. Gabe Vincent two assists. <laughs> Gabe Vincent two assists. I'm like, who is Gabe Vincent? Two assists. That's all you need to know. Yeah. Give it up. You're covered. <laughs> Um, yeah, and there's also another podcast called That's What I Heard, but it's by like people from the UK, and that's not my podcast. Yeah. Mine is the one by this trashy girl with the fake New York accent. I hate people from the UK. Really? Okay, well, you didn't have to. I know, I know, but <laughs> I do. Why, because they have teeth longer than you? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, what, what is going on over there with their teeth? It's, I don't know, but if comedy doesn't work out, we get a dentistry going there. <laughs> no, they don't go. Yeah, I also think dentistry is, a, I, I do believe in a conspiracy theory of dentistry is not necessary, well, unless you have an emergency. <laughs> I don't know. They're drilling holes in your face looking at gray areas going, yeah, yeah you yeah, need this. Yeah. It's like, yeah, no, I don't. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, I fucking don't. That's why you got to go to two mechanics. You got to go to two dentists. Yeah. yeah. Last guy said I had 13 cavities. You're it saying I got true. none? It is true. <laughs> so which, like, which is it? Wait until you have pain. Which is it? Yeah, the, wisdom, Fight it. the wisdom teeth thing is funny. It's like, yeah, you got too many teeth. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. We're going to charge you about $30,000 more now. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Really? You, you, they're all slime balls. You got too many fingers. We need to cut one off. It's going to be surgery. Anyway, it's a slow burn on the end of this, but uh, <laughs> I'm getting sleepy. <laughs> yeah, I know. You, you just looked at me so sleepy, tie fat, dead in the eyes, and you were trying to finish your bit, and you were just like, well, Chris does. Oh, they're going to need surgery. Chris does this thing where I'll, well, I'll, it's clearly we're putting a button on the episode trying You're to get so the sleepy, fuck off. Tie, tie. Put him to bed. Put him to bed. Let him go to bed. What do you have? No. Sh- what do you no, we got to do, Patre- we gotta do Patreon. Episode. I know oh, we do, Christ. but we're trying to put an end <laughs> to this. Christ, with the Patreon. Stop we with have the Patreon. To, we have to do. What are you bringing in? 2K a month? 5k 6k 7k 10k we're talking Tim Dillon numbers we're talking 200k no, we're not no. Tim Dillon numbers but we're doing that no we're doing alright that's good pays for the thank hey, you thank it, you for all the support if it pays yeah. for the first floor you know the vibes <laughs> <laughs> yeah. like, like review and subscribe we don't do that we should yeah, I started doing that. It's the most disgusting words it's, that I'll ever come out of your mouth. Of course. Yeah. I, would you rather get, I would rather get someone piss in my mouth 100%. Than, than have to say rate, review, subscribe one more time. Oh, disgusting. God. It is disgusting. Filthy. We might be, you might be the first or like third person we've asked to, do, to plug something. Rate, review, <laughs> and subscribe. Yeah, we always forget. Yeah, we, I, well, she said I have a new podcast, oh, okay, yeah. which made me re- remember yeah, yeah. Yeah. that we should be probably I ne- I never, doing we never, so. or not. We don't who even cares? plug our own dates. Who cares? No. Yeah. At the end of the day, who cares? Newport, who cares? Rhode Island. Actually, yeah, we'll be in Newport, <laughs> this, Rhode Island. This, this, this won't be next out week. now. Wow. Well, Newport, It won't be out Wednesday? No. Oh, yeah, it'll be week, weekend after that. Anyway, yeah. if you came out... <laughs> If you came Dude, out to the road comedy festival, in Newport. <laughs> Newport. Yeah. Dude, what a wild Yeah, we'll talk about it next week. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> we don't have time. So good. Historic <laughs> world. Holy shit. <laughs> Rhode Island's beautiful. Yeah. All right, you juice. Thanks for watching. Uh, all right. What did you just say? Uh, <laughs> I don't support that comment. I just want to say, don't, don't cut yet. I what? don't support that comment. <laughs> and cut. <laughs> <laughs>